Hey you guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. So for today's plant chores and chill with me episode, we're going to be repotting my philodendron blended onto a trifolium moss pole. I'm gonna be also repotting my golden pothos onto a wooden plank. I do want that one to climb, so that's gonna be really exciting to see the leaves get huge on that. And I will also just be showing you guys some of my propagations that I'm currently kind of working on um yeah i have some exciting updates with that as well so if you like that and you like more planty content please hit subscribe down below leave a like and yeah let's go ahead and get into this video okay you guys so here we have here my splendid on this other moss pole i originally put it on and here's the moss pole from trifolia and <laughs> also here is ace <laughs> For his um for his you know his guest star appearance so i'm gonna go ahead and just get this party started i did wait for this leaf to unfurl and you guys oh my goodness this is the newest leaf how stunning is that is that not gorgeous and it's the largest leaf and mind you you guys i received this as a one leaf cutting this is the original leaf and here is all of this growth so it's just always really exciting getting new leaves on watered it too so the soil is still moist but here we go <laughs> we have our plant here we're gonna go ahead and put this in here put some soil back in and voila we have completed this task <laughs> So here we have it. This is the <laughs> Philodendron Splendid on yet again another moss pole. But it will probably stay on this moss pole until it reaches the top. And then I will just keep propagating it and putting it back into the pot. I think that's going to be a, the plan for a lot of my plants um, going into, well, finishing this year and going into the new year. So yeah. And again, this newest leaf is still fresh and still hardening off, but so pretty. So now we have here my golden pothos. So I recently noticed that her leaves are starting to yellow near the base of the plant here. I may have overwatered this plant, but this plant has also been in this tiny little planter for basically all since the beginning of this year maybe so i think it may be just due for a repotting i'm not sure but yeah so we're gonna go ahead and take a look at the roots and see what's going on there also my plan for this plant is to plant it in this i believe this is a six inch terracotta or clay pot along with this wooden plank because i want huge golden pothos leaves and I think this would be a cool project to start so yeah we're gonna be putting that plant into this and yeah let's go ahead and get started <laughs> The plant wasn't terribly root bound, but I'm going to go ahead and put it in the six inch pot for the winter anyway, because you know, they, I know once I put it on this plank, 
I'm sure the roots will fill in the pot, you know. I'm not worried about this plant at all being in too big of a pot. Well, I'm only literally sizing up from this to this, so. Like, it's not too bad. So, yeah. <laughs> Hopefully the, the leaves won't yellow any further. I gave it some fresh soil and yeah, I got it um, tied up to the plank. So I'm gonna go ahead and water this in because it was a bit dry. It wasn't root bound, but I can tell the soil was just very depleted of the nutrients. So it should only go up from here. On to the propagation updates. Okay guys, just to kind of end off this video, um, I have a lot of propagation going on right now. So let's first start with these golden pothos cuttings. I took from the large, from, um, from my larger golden pothos, obviously. Um, the roots on this thing, like they are coming in crazy and also i don't know if you guys can tell but i also have a cutting of my hoya in here and that is rooting up nicely since so throwing that in here with my golden pothos propagations those roots are coming in really well i'm excited to pot this up and it being its own plant i'm so excited okay Gonna put that back in water for a tiny bit longer. Here's my um, jar of neon pothos cuttings. It's majority neon. I also have a golden pothos in here. And also, you guys, I recently, oh yeah. I recently got this unrooted philodendron painted lady cutting and I actually threw it in the water with my neon and golden pothos but since the node area is so short that they left on this cutting I'm actually not even seeing like a growing eye on here so I don't know what this is gonna do can you guys kind of like see that really well um, yeah, I'm not sure what this is going to do, but I really want to move this to perlite. So yeah, we're actually going to, um, after I show you guys these propagations, I thought I was going to end the video here, but I actually forgot until I saw it just now. Um, I'm going to move this to a perlite propagation so that way it has a better chance of pushing out a growing eye 
I don't want to leave. It's only been in water for about four days. It got here about four days ago. But I do want to go ahead and switch this over to perlite. Um, so yeah, this is my <laughs> Filled Under Painted Lady. And I also have these little baby um, variegated spider plant cuttings. And yeah, I'm super excited to grow a spider plant. I've never had a spider plant, so this should be interesting. I've watched a couple of care tip videos and yeah. I'm really excited for these roots to develop just a little bit more on these and I'll go ahead and um, do a video on potting these guys up as well when the time is right. So yeah, let's go ahead and put this bad boy in some perlite. Okay guys, so officially to um, end off this video for today, I'm going to just go ahead and plop this in my wet perlite here. It's just damp. It's not... Um, going to be sitting in any water. I'm just placing it in here gently. Alrighty, so that's just how that's looking. <laughs> going to go ahead and put this over in, on the grow light table. Okay, guys, so just placing this over here in some direct light here and yeah okay guys so that's gonna wrap it up for today's plant chores video again on your way out don't forget to hit like leave a comment hit subscribe and i will see you guys for my next planty video later